kids, today we're going to talk about how friendship works. Get ready! Have you ever made a list of your best friends in the whole world? Do it right now. Mine are Jessie. I just love her red hair. Bob, he's just a rock star. Dorothy, well, she's a little old for a fifth grader. Bubba Jr., he's just got the curliest hair. So who's on your list? Why are they such good friends? Now keep that list and think about this. Our friends rub off on us. Have you ever noticed that? The more you hang out with someone, the more you start acting alike. And sometimes friends even start looking alike. So this can mean their good habits start rubbing off on you, like being kind, including everyone, doing your homework, and so on. But it could also mean that their bad habits rub off on you, like bullying other kids, using bad language, disobeying parents, and so on. The point is this. We should pick our friends carefully. No. Pick our nose carefully, pick our friends carefully. It matters who you hang out with. Now you should be friendly with everyone, but your best friend list is different. If you have mean kids on that list, watch out, you'll be mean too. If you have disobedient kids on that list, be careful, you'll start disobeying too. That's what our memory verse is talking about. Do not be misled. Bad company corrupts good character. So pull out that friend list again. Is it a good list? Are there names on there that shouldn't be? Let your parents help you answer that question. Hang out with kids that make you a better kid. <laughs>